close till I get up. Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. Yes, I'm wearing the same shirt as my last video. I decided I was going to go ahead and kill two videos at one time. So, for this video, I'm going to be talking about five tips that I have for college freshmen or maybe college transfers. Since I just graduated college in May, I thought I would give you guys some tips on how to make your college life easier. So my first tip is to wake up early and take early classes. I know a lot of people are like, oh, it's college now, I can take afternoon classes. But honestly, afternoon classes suck. Once you're done with all your classes, the day's already over and you can't do anything else. So if you take all your classes before noon or one, you get the rest of the day to do whatever you want to do. And also I would suggest only taking classes on Tuesdays and Thursdays so you get to have a longer weekend. Your last day of school is on Thursday and you don't have to go back until Tuesday. Yes, the classes are longer, but you get more off days. So if you can, definitely try to sign up for Tuesday and Thursday classes. My second tip is to make sure that you're having fun but also make sure that you're studying. Try to find that balance in your life where you can have fun and spend time with all your new friends, but also make sure you're paying attention to your schoolwork because I know in college, it can be really easy to just kind of put off your schoolwork and hang out with your friends all the time. Because in college, you'll definitely probably have to study a little bit more than when, what you did in high school. Some of the courses are a lot harder, especially once you get to your junior and senior year of college. My third tip is to make sure that you call your parents. It's something that I didn't really do. My mom called me a lot instead of me calling her. I feel like when we're in college, we get so consumed with, you know, our friends, our schoolwork, everything that's going on there that we forget about our parents and back home and how they're doing especially if you moved out of state your parents are probably really worried about you so definitely give them a call whenever you get a chance and try to make more time for them and let them know what's going on in your life my fourth tip is actually something that i didn't do i would really suggest staying on campus for one year most schools have it mandatory where you have to stay on campus for your freshman year but there are a lot of schools that don't. I didn't get to stay on campus my freshman year because I went to a community college instead and transferred in my sophomore year, so I just went right into an apartment. But I think I missed out on a lot of things. I know that in a dorm it's a little bit easier to make friends because you have all the people in your hall, all the people in your dorm in general. They have all these get-togethers and meetings that come along with being in a dorm. And honestly, it's a really easy commute if you're just living on campus and you can just walk to class instead of having to drive on campus and probably pay for a parking sticker, which I know mine was, I think, a little bit over $200. So that's definitely one perk of staying on campus. My fifth and final tip is to enjoy college. Before you know it, these four or five years of your life are going to fly by and it's gonna be over. And then you're gonna go right into working or waiting to work. While you're in college, try to make new friends. Maybe join a club or two. Be more involved in school. Go to some of the games, because these are a lot of things that I didn't do. And in my senior year, honestly, most of the time, I was just sitting at home by myself. Since I lived alone, I didn't have roommates. I didn't really go out with my friends. I didn't really do anything. I just went to school, came home, and did my homework, and went to bed. And did it all over again every single day. So just make sure you're enjoying your time. Go out, have fun. Enjoy the town that your school is in. Get to know the area. Go to the football games. Be involved in like the homecoming week. Or look at some of the clubs they have. There are a lot of clubs in college. There's Christian clubs, choir clubs, theater clubs, business clubs. There's so many things that you can get involved in and I would really, really suggest it. Because after college is over, hopefully you've built your own network that'll hopefully help you get a job. That's something that I didn't do and something that I regret from my last four years. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed already, the button is down below or I'll put it right here. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left.